Welcome back to my channel and a very special welcome if you're new here. My name is Jen. I'm a certified weight loss and nutrition coach who has lost and maintained a 140 pound weight loss. And today we're going to talk about the healthiest options at 10 chain restaurants. That way when you go out to eat next time, you know what the healthiest option is. So if you're excited, give this video a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not. Turn your bell on because I upload new videos every Tuesday and Thursday. Check out the description box down below where I will link nutrition coaching. I do offer personalized macros and calories. This is how I lost and maintained my 140 pound weight loss as well as one-on-one -on -one coaching for accountability, questions, or to talk with me directly. So let's talk about 10 restaurants and the 10 healthiest options. Whether it's a date night, lunch with friends, out to dinner for a family night, it is really hard to keep your health goals in mind when we go out to eat. The menu looks so, a lot of the unhealthy options on the menu, all those pictures of the fried food, the pizza, the burgers look really, really good. And sometimes it's hard to choose a healthy option. And uh, most of the time we don't know what is really considered to be a healthy option. A lot of times the salad on the menu has more calories than if you were to pick that burger and fries. So if you eat out often and you struggle on choosing healthy options, I want to share with you 10 chain restaurants and the 10 healthiest options at those restaurants. Let me know down below if you would like a part two or even a part three of this video. I have about 30 different restaurants with 30 different healthy food options. I'd be happy to do another video for you. A lot of restaurants these days include the calories on the menu, which is really helpful. And like I said, sometimes those salad calories and fat in the salad can be more than the burger and fries. So it's nice to be able to have the knowledge of the calories on the menu. You also want to really focus on getting in some picking something that's high in protein, low in saturated fat, low in fat overall, and is going to include some type of vegetable or fruit, just so you have a little bit more balanced meal. It's all about making the healthiest choice possible when you go out to eat. So restaurant number one is going to be Chili's. And your healthiest option on the menu is the classic sirloin with avocado. And I can speak from personal experience that this meal is chef's kiss delicious. I will go ahead and pop the nutrition information of all of these meals here on the screen for you. This is a classic sirloin that is six ounces with avocado, cilantro, pesto, and pico served with the side of grilled asparagus. The entire meal is only 316 calories and has 39 grams of protein. That is absolutely incredible. The calorie protein ratio is spot on and you're getting a side of grilled asparagus. So you're getting a vegetable as part of your meal and then topping that sirloin steak with the avocado gives you a healthy fat. Really truly, this is one of the healthiest meals you can consume whether you're out to dinner or making it at home. So this is the go-to for chili. Now, sometimes we love a good breakfast out. I know breakfast is my favorite meal of the day. I love breakfast foods. And when we go out to eat, sometimes it's really hard to choose a healthy breakfast option. So if you're visiting your local Perkins, your best bet on the menu is the build your own omelet with mushrooms, spinach, and peppers. The build your own omelet is really the healthiest thing that you can order, depending on what you choose to put on it. Fill it with fresh fresh vegetables like spinach, mushroom, and pepper that are going to give you a lot of vitamin C and vitamin D and a lot of the nutrients, micro, and a lot of the micronutrients that come in vegetables. If you want a little cheese, get some American or pepper jack cheese on top. This omelet's going to deliver 21 grams of protein, which is absolutely fantastic for breakfast. We always want to start our day off with a big bang of protein. So if you're at Perkins, this is what I would recommend you order. Number three is Ruby Tuesdays. Now we don't have Ruby Tuesday where I live, but I've been there before. They have excellent food, but a lot of their food is very high calorie, very high fat. So next time you're at a Ruby Tuesday, you can choose the grilled salmon. Lightly seasoned salmon is only 330 calories and has 39 grams of protein. It also only has 470 milligrams of sodium, which is actually really low compared to most restaurant meals. You can add two of their fit and trim sides to make this a really well-rounded meal, but you can't beat the protein again versus the calorie ratio. And salmon has so such great omega-3 omega-6 fatty acids that are really, really important for a balanced diet. Number four comes from TGI Fridays. Again, not a restaurant we have locally, but a restaurant I have been to in the past. And your best bet, again, is their grilled salmon, but the TGI Fridays is going to come with lemon butter, broccoli, and mashed potatoes. This is a complete meal that's balanced and satisfying. It has a ton of nutrients and a flavorful balanced meal with 34 grams of protein, plenty of fiber, and omega-3 fatty acids, and only 530 calories. 
So an entire meal, including mashed potatoes, salmon, and vegetables for just over 500 calories. You can't beat it. And all of the nutrients and vitamins in the salmon, the veggies, and the balanced carb of mashed potatoes, incredibly healthy choice. Number five is Cheesecake Factory. I mean, who doesn't love a Cheesecake Factory meal? Unfortunately, Cheesecake Factory is one of the highest calorie, one is the most caloric dense restaurants out there. I will say, and speaking from personal experience, their skinny licious chicken tacos, absolutely incredible. You're going to get three soft shell tacos filled with chicken, avocado, tomato, onion, cilantro, and cream. Plus you'll get a vegetable side. Lean protein and veggies and only 830 milligrams of sodium, which is only 36% of your daily value. So the sodium again on this is really low for a restaurant style meal. You're also only going to have 15 grams of fat and get over 30 grams of protein. These tacos are so good and that little bit of cream makes them feel really, really decadent and they are so good for you. So healthy, so low calorie. Let's talk about Applebee's because this is another restaurant that gets a pretty bad rap for its unhealthy food choices. But again, if you go with a salmon option at Applebee's, you can get a really healthy meal. Their blackened Cajun salmon is what I would recommend. It's a delicious way to get in healthy omega-3 fatty acids. Skip the garlic, ma garlic mashed potatoes that are often served with this meal to keep it lower sodium and reduce the saturated fat. The salmon alone is going to have 38 grams of protein. That's incredible. Healthy fat. It's going to have a lot of healthy fats. And then you add that side of broccoli for some added fiber and to get your veggie in. So again, skipping the potatoes is a good option. Option. Now, if you're really craving some mashed potatoes, have some mashed potatoes. Maybe just eat half of what comes with the meal, but make sure you're adding on that broccoli side. Number seven is Red Robin. I love a good Red Robin burger. And Red Robin actually has a salad option that is really healthy. And that's their Simply Grilled Chicken Salad. It's simple and satisfying with sliced grilled chicken breasts on top of mixed greens, cheddar cheese, tomato, croutons, and cucumbers. You'll get plenty of vegetables and 37 grams of protein, which helps keep you nice and full. And only 340 calories is about a quarter of the calories in most restaurant salads. Like I said, a salad can be more calories and fat than a burger and fries. But this grilled chicken option is going to give you protein, vegetables, and a healthy option at Applebee's. Number seven is good old P.F. Chang's, another restaurant that is known for super high, high for super high calorie, high fat food. Your best bet is going to be their steamed Buddha feast. Now the fact that the word feast is in the title would make you think it's not healthy, but this is an amazingly healthy meal. It's a steamed dish with tofu, white sauce, garlic, green beans, mushrooms, cabbage, broccoli, and carrots. And getting this steamed option is going to save you saturated fat as well as about 620 milligrams of sodium. Tofu is an excellent source of plant-based protein. I know that you are able to substitute chicken with this meal. If you're not a tofu eater, you can substitute chicken and it still becomes a really, and it becomes is equally healthy meal. This entire meal is only 120 calories and contains 11 grams of protein. So like I said, adding in chicken breast is going to really elevate the protein. It is going to add some calories, but it's going to double if not triple the protein content of this meal. So go for this at P.F. Chang's and then maybe just take little bites and small amounts of some of the other food that is at your table. Number nine is Olive Garden. And you may be thinking, oh great, at Olive Garden I'm going to have to have a salad. No, you actually can have pasta. The spaghetti with meat sauce is a healthy choice. Make sure you're getting the lunch sized entree. It's just 360 calories and it's going to give you 17 and a half percent of your recommended saturated fat and only 23 percent of the sodium for your day. The fact that you added the meat sauce is going to give you 14 grams of protein. And it's a great source of lycopene, which is an antioxidant found in tomatoes. So you can still have pasta at Olive Garden. Just make sure you choose the lunch sized portion and you get the meat sauce for the added protein. And number 10 is Red Lobster. Now you may be thinking Red Lobster, great at seafood. It's all healthy. Unfortunately, Red Lobster can be pretty calorically dense and packed with a lot of saturated fat. However, if you get their grilled rainbow trout, you can have a really healthy meal. And I'll tell you again from personal experience, it's incredibly delicious. It's one of the healthiest options on the menu. It's high in protein, which is essential for building and repairing tissues in the body and rich in omega-3 fatty acids, which has been proved which has been linked to improved health, heart, brain function, and reduce inflammation in the body. The entire meal is 550 calories, but you're going to get 68, 68 grams of protein. That's amazing. Those, that macro ratio, 
couldn't be better. And like I said, the grilled trout is really delicious. Doesn't have a lot of fishy flavor. It's a white fish, so it's a lot less fishy tasting and it's grilled to perfection. You can add to the benefits of this meal by even putting a vegetable side and you can still enjoy one of those delicious red lobster biscuits. So those are 10 chain restaurants and 10 healthy options. Again, let me know down below if you'd like a part two or even a part three of this video. And also let me know what you which one of these meals is your favorite? And do you have any other healthy options at these restaurants that you would recommend? Let us know down in the comments. And don't forget to check out the description box for nutrition coaching. Highly recommend those personalized macros and calories, as well as links and discounts to my favorite healthy things. Don't forget to thumbs up the video and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.